This piece is called Song for Seneca Maca. Seneca Maca is the Native American name for where I live, uh, the eastern side of Virginia. Uh, you've all heard of Pocahontas, probably. Uh, well, Powhatan was Pocahontas' father, and uh, uh, Powhatan's village, main village, was uh, discovered just a few years ago uh, in Gloucester County, Virginia, which is where I live. So uh, several years ago, I was doing some reading about uh, interactions between the uh, early English settlers and the uh, Indians that were already there. And uh, I was inspired to write uh, a series of pieces, which I put together and called the Powhatan Suite. Uh, it came out on a CD of mine in 2003. And uh, Song for Seneca Maca is the closing piece from that suite. So uh, I hope you en enjoy it. Um, the, the main thing that I think of musically when, uh, when I uh, play this tune, or when I, when I talk about this tune, is just kind of the idea of, uh, of melody. Uh, and melody being uh, sometimes uh, right in front of your face. You know, you don't have to go uh, playing something ridiculously hard or fast or searching, you know, uh, all over the place to find some, kind, some cool melody. Sometimes it's just right there in some very easy chords. Um, in this case, uh, you know, the, the, the very first move I made was to do this uh, one day, and I thought, wow, I like that. And followed it up with some other very, very simple chords. And, uh, you know, as you learn the tune, you'll see what I mean, I hope. Um, you know, I try to learn something from every uh, song that I uh, either compose or that I learn uh, and arrange. And, uh, and that's the thing that I learned, really, from this tune, was just a, a, a reminder, again, of, uh, you know, just to look for that melody. Sometimes it, it just sometimes it's right there in front of you, you know? and let that happen. Um, you know, you, it's not just the melody in here. Uh, the melody may look very simple and sound very simple, but there's a, a fair bit of uh, uh, trickiness that goes into uh, making the right hand work, you know, a fair bit of finesse, maybe, um, to making the right hand really deliver uh, the melody in the way that I intended. And uh, that's how you should try to play it, as the composer intended, right? So anyway, um, have fun with this tune, and, uh, and I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. 